Hey guys, welcome to my video. So today's video is actually about the same motor um, that I did the other night, except um, the motor I did the other night um, was an attraction. So those of you that didn't see that one, um, you could refer back to that. But this is the rotor for the other video when it was an attraction. So um, these were the coils. These are mounted inside here. And um, it was just a traction. So I took out this rotor and I replaced it with a magnet rotor. So these are um, double stack magnets, but four of them, and they're all in the same polarity, uh, which is in repulsion to the electromagnet. And so as this actuates, it pushes this away and then it turns off, and then the magnet naturally turns into the coil, um, attracting the, the steel core. So it's kind of a really neat motor. I've done quite a few videos on it. Um, you know, you basically get a quarter of the rotation per magnet. Um, it's just the attraction of it, and then it pushes away. So um, it's really neat. And so I still have the four opto disc timing. And then this is just my little MOSFET circuit uh, with pulse width. I have these on my website, uh, kenergy.store. And so basically we have the coils coming into here and then this is the optical timing uh, I have a little switch um, to override the pulse width modulator a uh, little opto and then the diode split off so what happens is every time this turns off you know it turns off four times per revolution um, you get a high voltage flyback spike and these diodes collect that and it goes into the second battery so these are the charge batteries and this is run battery um, they're both set up for 20, 24 volts each so two batteries in series and um, this will be our input and output amperage so let's um, let's fire this up so at the moment you can see it kind of self oscillating um, I don't I don't have it self starting because um, I just started building this motor I'm gonna have four more coils so it'll be a total of six coils with three circuits um, but I thought I would do a video on this first because this is really neat running motor so I'll start turning it up here so at 24 volts it runs pretty pretty nice so uh, we're using an amp and a half and then we're doing uh, half an amp recovery to the second battery and uh, here's our waveform and then let's check the RPM. So the RPMs are 42, oh, 4200 RPMs. And then we could adjust the speed and everything with the pulse width. So as you engage the pulse width, you can see it kind of chop it up. We could reduce the amperage. So if we get it down to about a half an amp, um, we're right around 50% recovery kind of cool and um, yeah it's just a smooth running motor so thanks for watching guys don't forget to check out my website and next video on this motor we'll have more coils thanks for watching